So I'm so glad you're with me. This printout, this free printable, comes from my free reading per curriculum. And this is, we're on frame three right now. If you want to get a copy of it, leave a comment below and I will, I will get you a free copy. Um, the p printouts that you will see in the PDF are like this. This is the first one. And you'll cut the shapes out. I prefer you print it out on cardstock just because cardstock is easier for little ones to handle. But if not, it's no big deal. And you can, you cut the pieces out and you let your little one glue it on there. The butterfly can either go landscape or portrait. It fits either way. My husband says this looks like a fly, but it's a butterfly. <laughs> and that is for the, that's the first one you're going to do because it has this week's shapes on it. It has the oval, the right angle triangles, and the rhombus head with the rhombus eyes. It does look a little weird, I guess. <laughs> The next one we're gonna do is the cargo truck. And this is what the printout looks like. The cargo truck is going to have to be done in landscape just for it to fit. And this is what it looks like when it's all done. And the precious cargo is the oval of the isosceles and the ellipse shape. That, that's the precious cargo the truck's carrying. And the last one is the gumball machine. This one might be a little harder for your older ones to cut out just because of all the circular gumballs. It might be overwhelming. It might just, the circles are the hardest things to cut out. Even I still have trouble with that. I did want to give you one little tip. When, with your younger ones who are just learning to use a glue stick, let them glue all over the initial paper. Just glue, let them glue it down, glue all over it. And then have them place the pieces on top of the paper, you know, and kind of um, guide them on how to do that and maybe push it a little closer to the square maybe move the triangle up a little bit you know and use those vocabulary words those shape names um, and then for the gumballs just have them glue in the gumball machine here and put the gumballs on top and that is it for the shape exercise I'll put week one's video that goes in more detail about this exercise down below in the description. This is a great exercise for pre-writing that pincher grip with the glue stick, for lining up shapes, and just for an overall review of the shapes and their names. If you want a copy of my free reading curriculum, leave a comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to hit subscribe for more educational resources.